guys, welcome back to the channel for another energy drink review episode. Today I got a, uh, trying a new rock star here for a change. Um, you know, that, that I've kind of, uh, fell off the wagon when it came to rock stars because they freaking, um, you know, discontinued my favorites, right? But I seen this in the, uh, in the gas station I'm not normally in the other day. Uh, it's a smaller can. So this is only a 12 ounce can, but that's, uh, the flavor is passion fruit. Dig the coloration there, the white and the, uh, white background with the purple stars and the purple there. Nice, nice coloring there. So decent, uh, decent look of the can. Uh, this one says, um, has an herbal blend. Herbal blend and hemp seed. So I looked on the ingredients, it does have hemp seed oil. So I was like, hmm, I've, I've heard some things about that. That's definitely a, um, a name floated around, you know, when it comes to, like, uh, uh, herbs and uh, health uh, supplements, you know, okay? Um, you know, I've done my fair share of watching videos on, you know, uh, healthy living foods, herbs, uh, natural supplements, and that one's uh, one that I've uh, seen, quite, seen and heard quite a bit. Uh, but let's, uh, before I taste it out, let's get into the specs. Now it's got the numbers I like, zero calorie, zero sugar, zero carbs, on point, alright. Um, also has uh, 80 to 100% of your B vitamins there. So three different uh, B vitamins, so pretty decent. Now, for some of you, you're like, alright, that's fine and dandy like peppermint candy, <laughs> but what? tell me the good stuff, what about the caffeine? Uh, now the caffeine content it does actually come in light uh, it only has 80 milligrams so if you're really dragging this one's probably not going to help you out as much but if you're just like i'm going to say middle of the afternoon and you're feeling a little sluggish which it is right now that's so that's the case with me here because it, it is in the afternoon 4:20. um I am feeling a little sluggish. I'm, I'm playing some Tecmo Super Bowl II Special Edition for the Sega Genesis. I just got this uh, delivered uh, today. From, it's another eBay find. But in the third, I'm take, I'm practicing with the Chargers here. In the third quarter, I'm playing the Cleveland Browns, and uh, I'm only up nine to seven in the third quarter. So we're feeling a little sluggish. So it's like, all right, time maybe a good time for this here. Maybe it can help me out, help us out a little bit. But yeah, that's pretty much it. This, but as far as caffeine content, this is pretty light, you know, compared to a lot of other energy energy drinks. But like I said, if you're just late in the afternoon, just needing just a little bit of pick me up, then possibly this could be a good option for you. So let's crack it open and taste it out. Oh wow, that's got some coloration there. I don't know if you can see that. It's like, yeah, eh, you might not be able to, but here, let, let's let's taste it out. Smell it first. Passion fruit, but it's, it's like yellow. Okay. Mm. Okay, it's pretty enjoyable, pretty smooth. Uh, passion... Uh, you know, passion fruit, you know, it kind of, um, it tastes very peachy, I'm going to say. And I like peach. Hmm. Damn. That's kind of nice. I like it. Yeah, I'm going to say it's very uh, peachy, very tropical, you know, tropical fruity. Uh, there, maybe you can see a little bit of the coloration of the liquid there so it's not clear for you people that care about that um it's decent i like i kind of like it um and it's i'm gonna say low on the carbonation that maybe that's why it feels so smooth because if it's the more carbonated it is it's gonna be a little rougher going down that's very smooth so i'm gonna say very uh low on the carbonation uh medium on the sweetness okay it's and there's no there's no sourness or tartness at all 
So I'm going to say semi-sweet, but medium, you know, okay? It's not overly sweet, but it's there is some sweetness there. And then the flavor, okay? Um, that's pretty good. I'm, let's go one more before I... Yeah. <clears throat> yeah. Uh, it can use some more flavor, but it's got a decent there. So I'm going to give it a 7.9 on the flavor, okay? I'd recommend it, especially it's only a 12-ounce can. It's only 80, uh, 80 uh, milligrams of caffeine. Got some good B vitamins in there for you. You know, got some hemp seed oil in there for you. <laughs> so... I'm not really sure what the benefits of that are. You can look that up yourself. I mean, I like I said, I've heard it float. That, I've heard hemp seed and hemp seed oil floated around in the uh, you know uh, fitness and nutritional uh, communities, right? So uh, definitely, there's some. Uh, I've heard talks about there's benefits to it. Uh, but you're welcome to do your own research when it comes to that. I could say I'd recommend this though. It's pretty decent, especially it's. That's like okay, cool. Rockstar, I can a new Rockstar. I can say it's pretty good. It, it doesn't replace those other ones. My favorites that are, are no longer here. Um, you know, I like those better, of course. But hey, uh, just lately I haven't been too much into Rockstar because you know they got the Pure Zero and they're okay. But uh, I don't know. This kind of they were they were just kind of mediocre to me. You know. Um, so, but I'm gonna say this is probably right along with them. But again, it's but it's pretty good taste. Though. I'm gonna say I'm gonna dig the taste a little bit better than some of those pure zeros I've had. But have you guys heard of this Rockstar? And they're calling it Unplugged. So Rockstar Unplugged. That's the that's this line, right? You had Rockstar Pure Zero. Now Unplugged. You got the Recovery. And before, the ones I liked, it was like the Exdurance and the Thermo. It's like, that's what I'm saying. It's like, to me, Rockstar had like so many, it's just kind of all over the place, these different lines. And then flavors in each of those lines. It's like, I don't know, some, you know, you know I think you need to be a little bit more focused than that. You know, a little too many irons in the fire there when you got like, when you're just all over the place like that, right? But anyways, I digress. Um... Rockstar Unplugged Passion Fruit. You guys checked it out? Have you tried it? What's your thoughts on it? Let me know in the comments below, and I'll get back to you as soon as I can. But if this is your first time to the channel, tap the subscribe button down there, then the bell next to it, ding, ding, and that way you'll be notified when I upload new videos. If you do that, that would be retro rad, okay? And I'd be much obliged. So until next time, guys... Keep it retro.